hello guys so welcome to this video tutorial so in this video we'll see uh, we'll make this electrical circuit one battery structure you can see here okay by using Visio application we'll do this and we'll export this figure in a good quality figure okay in good quality so that you can use this figure in your professional uh, work okay or in your journal paper or anywhere you can export and create video uh, figures like that so <coughs> we can see here we have so many components of electrical engineering so capacitor resistor and some connector okay only this mainly yeah so <coughs> we need first resistor we'll just search it here okay will not go by library by library uh, it's not coming so let's go more shape go to engineering then electrical engineering okay fundamental items physio here we got resistors we'll just left click and drag it wait left click and drag it okay oh it's so small so we have to increase the size that's it huh? and then uh, we need capacitor okay where is capacitor capac Ay, a capacitor here is capacitor okay let's make it lit bigger then register capacitor okay only register and capacitor okay we'll just copy paste everything okay just clear control c control v and then control r to rotate okay <coughs> here one register one capacitor then control c control we need one capacitor in this side also okay now let's place it within the grid okay for aligning then it will be very easy sorry yeah try to keep it within grid line mm, then we need capacitor one offside here also then we need so many more control C control V one capacitor here <coughs> control R one register control C control V we'll just connect with uh, connector okay you can see later we need one more here we'll just zoom it little bit more here now so many more grid games let's connect it first just go to this connector okay you can see here connector we'll connect all this
look it's so easy okay we'll try to keep it pointer to within that grid line look so good now this this one within a grid line this one within grid line I'm not sure it's feasible for you or not the grid line I think maybe it's feasible it's not that much dark connector you connect this you can easily adjust connect here let's try to keep it little down no? the pointer tool select it look scale down now it's almost middle you see. then we have to connect this also so we need that connector again we'll connect with the connector then let's go to pointer tool because we need to adjust the position okay just left click and drag okay that's it for connecting at downside also we have one line that's it so now let tell something slipped that is <coughs> those arrow okay those arrow so we need arrow where here we need one arrow we'll just make one arrow by this connector A small arrow it's not straight line so right click on it go to straight connector go to line arrow right click it came arrow came okay you can see here we'll just control c control v we'll just paste it here okay where we need we need one upside we'll move it like this look look control r sorry so we'll change the direction here again the arrow direction okay so it came upside is it visible nicely now or oh, let me do one thing i'll just the pointer tool i'll select all those and i'll go to line i'll change line width with three points okay i think it's nicely visible now yeah i'll paste here place it here because of those grid lines so i have to zoom again to get that grid line okay yeah it's perfect now so easy things look if you want to give names we can place it little bit you can just click on it you can give name r 
Okay, so small, so we'll increase the size 50. Look, okay. Or you just simply you can use this text box, or you can use here for this R R 50. Okay, for same also cap or capacitor also both you can you can just double click on it automatically it will come for any connector also double click on it the naming will come okay so that's it guys it's same oh, i'm just not giving the no, those name okay you can adjust these positions of this register okay so if you have any doubt you can comment in the comment box same figure a plus minus uh, those plus and minus symbol you also can create with uh, connector also look like that you can create okay mentor tool select one look you can create plus like this also or you can just insert from here na? more shape which are general basic shape in basic shape I think yeah uh, leave it don't use this one just go to text box double click here and use your keyboard plus or whatever you need minus multiplication anything okay whatever you need you can use from your keyboard just by using text box okay so that's it now we'll export this figure in 300 dpi okay in 300 dpi we will export this let's delete this so we'll go to file save as uh, select your ok we'll go to this pc browse we'll just select where i want to save save I have saved that file in uh, Visio format. Now I'll save as coding uh, Visio. I'll change the file format. You can so many file formats are here as your requirements. You can use. I'll use here TIA file. TIA file is best for image file. Okay, save now you don't need to change anything here you just change the background color make it white commonly white is uh, necessary for a view okay. now in resolution just click on this custom and put 300 300 so 300 dpi figure it will come and size keep it source size okay and click on ok so you will get a high quality figure this figure one ah, this one is visio file sorry sorry tia file oh. it does not can go out yeah it cut little bit no we can adjust that one also Is it cut? No, no, no. It's okay. Look, I is okay. If we <coughs> delete all these things, we will we'll delete all these things, okay? 
group delete 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 now it came only one page page two page will control all will create one group here so we can move it okay we'll just adjust the position okay little bit left okay so now we'll again save this some are not good here look no? we can adjust this thing for that we have to select all first we have to ungroup it okay now we can adjust this oh, sorry let's, let's just delete it let's zoom it little bit so that grid will come we'll use the connector okay connect it line width we have to change three that's it it's looking good now yeah now save again go to save as will save in tif format save we'll replace it we'll save it custom 300 300 and size will keep it source okay let's go to that figure look now it came properly okay it now now it came so properly if we zoom as long as we'll zoom it there's no problem it will come okay quality is so good of this figure so that's it guys I think if you have any doubt of this also you can comment in the coin box i'll try to solve your problem whatever you are thinking whatever you are facing problem any problem in vg you are facing you can comment in the comment box bye bye